Hi, my name is Natalie D'Souza. I'm a junior double majoring in public relations and economics. Uh, I'm from Jackson, New Jersey, and I aspire to go into financial public relations in the future. I had to take Econ 102 for um, my PR track, so I ended up really liking Econ. I took, one of, I took a micro and macro class, and then I really liked it and took on the double major. But I think it also really shows how you could like any class, and you can also incorporate it in PR in any way, because there's the whole financial PR sector. I would found it interesting that you know a lot of big banks, a lot of huge financial firms also have their PR people, so it's really cool. They don't seem alike, but PR skills can always help in you know working in team settings in the econ field, and knowing like consumer background in the econ field always helps in the PR field. Yeah, so one of the greatest ways I got to incorporate the two in an outside organization is I joined the Economics Association, and in that I'm actually the print education associate. So I do the weekly newsletter for Econ Association. So I'm honing in my writing skills that I learned in PR, but also, you know, writing about relevant economics topics. But I think that's one of the main, like, great ways I got to incorporate both my majors in one outside organization. And then in my PR organizations, such as I'm in Happy Valley Communications, I managed to get roles where I'd be able to incorporate um, economics as well. Like right now I'm the director of business affairs for Happy Valley Communications, which is a student-run comm firm right here in State College. And I help you know, uh, get clients from downtown State College. I talk to them and recruit them, and I tell them kind of the benefits, you know, the opportunity costs, everything of joining with us. So it was really cool to get a lot of business analyst skills as well while being in a whole communications firm. Yeah, so currently I'm the marketing and communications intern for the Penn State College of Nursing. I ended up getting that internship last year after you know one of the emails Bob Martin sent. <laughs> and I it was amazing because it was my first real internship and you know they took a chance. I was their first real intern and I've been there for now next semester will be my third semester with them. So it's really cool. In there I get to design graphics, I write articles highlighting research students, faculty. Um, it really has given me the create like they gave they've given me a lot of space to hone in whatever skills I wanted. I learned a little bit of Adobe Creative Cloud, but in this internship, I use it every day now. So it's really cool. And then over the summer, I had a marketing internship with Jenkinson's Boardwalk in Point Pleasant, New Jersey. So it was really cool working with a beach and doing you know their marketing um, in a beach that I went to as a kid. <laughs> like I went to that beach probably, even as a teenager, you'd go to the boardwalk on the weekends, um, do the rides. So it was really cool being able to do PR and marketing for a place that was close to me. And then this summer, I actually am, has, have a finance internship with Johnson & Johnson. So I'm really excited to get have PR experience, then finance experience, so that I have both aspects for financial PR in the future. Everyone around you here is, to, is here to help you. Um, even though you might be nervous to branch out and join different organizations, if, even if you're nervous, you know, you think you don't have time to join different orgs, like you have it in you and everybody is here like guiding you on your way. Um, you have peers that will be peers forever who are in the workforce that you'll always have contact with, teachers, um, you know, career services. And I think just be, I think, I think that branching yourself out and just knowing that everybody kind of has your back here is like a great thing to know about. And I've always felt that everyone has my back here, and whether it's a PR say, like a academic organization, whether it's in my Thalen org, or even in both colleges I'm in, um, I always feel like someone has my back looking out for me.